What's going on, y'all? You know who it is. Mr. Warmack, a.k.a. Low Rent, a.k.a. The Ignorant American, a.k.a. The Truth As You Know It, a.k.a. Dirty Business, a.k.a. The Jet Jaguar of YouTube. Alright, man, you see the pretty face. And today I'm going to talk about a topic that I rarely talk about on social media in general because this this topic is talking, it's like too easy to talk about this topic. And so, I will talk about the ignorance of a few that affect the majority. If you want to know what I'm talking about, somebody else wants to know what I'm talking about. Back by popular man, good luck, Jonathan, everybody, the ex-president of Nigeria. And he's like, now who the hell is this dude talking about? I'm talking about a different kind of breed of animal. I'm talking about the new age. Four, three, there you go. Talk about these new age coons we got, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm going to tell you what the new age coons are. Okay. Now, I'm on Facebook, on plenty of groups. And if you put me in a group, I'm chill with it. And like, if I don't like it, I'll leave. And I'll just say, hey, don't ever ask me to do it again. I won't tell you. I'll just put that little X on there. But I'm in this one group. Chill group. And uh, I'm in there, and we, when we were talking about, uh, they were talking about, you know, stretch marks and setting the fifth. You no, know, doing, you know, and hey, you know, I've noticed, like, a lot of younger ladies have stretch marks and a lot of older chicks. The older chicks, back in the day, didn't go directly to the club after they dropped their kid. They went to the, you know, they did a wild boy, went to some water, went to the gym, or did where to tone the area up, and then they proceeded to go back out. Well, I said, I made a comment and said, hey, man, stay out of the club and go to a health club. I said, most of it is your laziness and you don't want to be able to fix it. I replied to that. It was like, you know, a lot of people agree with me. You know, there's more people who agree, will agree with me, but they don't, they're afraid of what other people will say to them because of the way I say things. Okay, so. This one lady that jammed the set in the fifth. I was like telling her, you know, hey, you, I was, I was your confidence in telling her, hey, if you just, just, just go to them and try. A real simple equation for her. And now, if people can understand this, you can understand the workings of these cones who don't understand this. I gave her this equation. I said, say you're, say you're busting 4,000 calories. Say you're, say you're, I'm not saying you're doing that every day. Say you're in that range. 4,000 calories. Some days it's lower, some days it's higher, depending on what you know, depending on your day. Now, say you're, you're consistently, have, you don't have for your life, let's say. Now, if you jump on a, a treadmill for 20 minutes a day, at a, at a, just to get your elevated heart rate elevated to where, quote unquote, it should be, you're going to lose weight because you're, 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 elevated heart rate and what happens whenever you're at your elevated heart rate you start burning fat now if you can get my equation with 4,000 calories and you losing weight off of that most normal people most people with an IQ above a grapefruit can understand where I'm coming from I told her just by just do I go on the treadmill you can lose weight eating what you're eating right now no, I'm not saying you can eat your fucking pizzas. You know, you can go out and eat, you know, uh, you know, a box of ice cream every day, you know, a whole gallon. I'm just being, you know, just what you're eating now. So you just hop on 20, 20 minutes a day. All right, simple equation. I, I don't want to start people out hard and make it sound hard. Well, all of a sudden, you know, here come the niggas. You know, they want, they want to say this, I say that. I'm, I'm like, look, man. I said, I said, this is why I like the internet, like with Facebook at times. This is why I like Facebook, but most times I don't like Facebook. I said, I did not say anything of that. Said, look what I said. And then the chick tried to tell me, well, you're telling her she can look like Kelly Rowland if she exercises. Number one, you can look like Kelly Rowland if you exercise. You know what it's called? It's called something that niggas don't have. It's called discipline. Look, I'm sure Kelly Rowan doesn't roll around up every night like you guys think he does. I'm sure Kelly Rowan isn't sitting around eating a box of eating a box of bonbons and eating two, uh, no, two Papa John's pizzas every day. It's called discipline. Niggas don't have discipline. They have excuses, but they don't have discipline. 
And then, then one chick was talking about, well, loose skin, step back, this, and the third. Look, I understand completely about the loose skin. But let's make, it, let's make this point clear. Crystal, clear as crystal. No, that's not every case of every woman. Every woman doesn't have a bunch of uh, loose skin. The fact of the matter is a lot of y'all drop your kids and go to a club. Y'all want to get out? It's how it is. But, but I, like I said, I understand the loose skin. I understand some people have too much loose skin that's that in the fifth. But let's not make it like every woman had loose skin. That's just the excuse you want to use. And then I was saying, then I got accused of saying this, that, blah, 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 blah. And then, like, and I'm, and I'm saying, I said, look, I said, I'm talking to a certain degree. I said, I'm not saying that, like, like if a lady wanted to pigeonhole me in the saying, I said this, I said that. You can't pigeonhole me because I know how it is. It's not, it's like to a certain degree. And then, and then like, she agreed with me, and then she still wanted to fight me. It's like, where do you get these Negroes at? Where, where they, where they, what well, laboratory, which is blown up, by the way, that builds you inferior GED not having ass Negroes at? You know, and then I gave, like I said, then she got mad with, I gave her the treadmill equation. You like, she's gonna lose, I was like, she's gonna lose weight. Huh? I said, if you don't exercise and you start off doing 20 minutes, you're burning fat at that heart rate. I'm not starting, I'm not starting start to let you off doing the goddamn PX, P90X exercise off the bat. <coughs> Excuse me, I was about to go in on them right there, but I decided to let that go. And I'm like, then, then. And then she's assuming, well, I told her she was lazy because a lot of the, a lot of people won't go exercise. I said, I met a lot more people in my life, people on fucking Facebook. As people were lazy and make tons of excuses, dude, get out of stuff. I said, hell, I used to do used to use excuses to get out of things I didn't want to do. So yes, people are lazy. And then, and then, and then, and then you, you know, the, 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 the nigger and shit you ever you want to do. They start wanting to nitpick every word you're saying. And I said, I was to the point after that, fuck you, bitch. Let's go. I, I was like, I was ready to go at her. And then all of a sudden, she decided to quit. And I got somebody smartened her up. But what, 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 what's wrong with these? And then, and then I made a comment, and I, it's still up there. I made a comment. I'm one of, like, one of my friends in this group. And I'm going to have him tell you. The only thing that's believed, you dumb motherfuckers, the only thing these dumb motherfuckers believe is when it's coming from a white person. And Because I've done it before. I, I've told black people something, niggas didn't believe me. So what I did is, went to my friend, told him what to tell them. Well, so-and-so said you were right. I know he did, because I told him to tell you. But that's, that's, that's how you got to play these niggas. You got to play them like you're stupid. I don't give niggas any credit, no more credit than they deserve, or that none. How do you want to give these niggas credit? You don't want to, and, uh, and I don't. I, I like, I, once I see that you're ignorant and you're, and like, hell, here's how ignorant they are. They don't know what second, <coughs> excuse me, <coughs> they don't know second and third person you. This is how you learn in elementary school. They don't know the difference between second person and third person you. They don't want a second, uh, second plural, second singular, second, third plural, third singular. They never know the difference. So that's why these news TV stations, when they said when you got get shot, well, they're shooting at me. Oh, they were shooting your city dummy. They're talking about you, third person, plural. That's why, that's why I, I can't, I, I'm, I'm like Chris Rock nowadays. I just can't stand these niggas no more. Because they're ignorant. They don't know what they're talking about. And in, 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 the, in the black community, we suppressed our own truths about these fools. That we let them talk so long that it's like to the part of they're speaking for us, which they're not, thank God. But, like, you can't just meet people because they get all offended. <laughs> they get offended. I'm like, are you kidding me? These black, these black, I do bastards get offended. And then they come at me, and they, and they all have these fucking expensive fucking sport coats, expensive shirt names, and they don't have fucking a dollar to their name. But man, let me end this. I'm saying I'm tired. I'm tired of it now. And like, like I said, Facebook is good because it brings you people together. Facebook is bad because niggas come along. And I'm not, not going to say, and, and before, before y'all start your little whining, there's bad in every race. But I'm not talking about that. I'm talking about niggas. So, I'm out. I got things to do. And I hope.